check out this find. This is our electronic fish collar. This was produced years ago, and we had a lot of success with it. We then had a couple of uh, store owners, bait shops, pick this up um, in the south and in the north, and they loved it. They loved it, and we then were promoting this to our kits, our uh, learn to solder kits, our very simple kits for like students at Cheney Electronics. Uh, I think we took it offline to sell to them. And throughout all this, it just never made its way back online. It was kind of forgotten about. And I saw it in the back. I'm like, hey, that's the fish uh, collar. Um, so I went to look it up on our website, and it's not even our website. So I'm going to plug it in. It makes this little kind of crankbait sound, you know, as you're you're fishing and sort of thing and it sounds like a cricket what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this thing in a Ziploc bag I think that's a probably a pretty good seal put the battery in there I don't know maybe throw even a cork in there too you know get an old cork, throw it in there, attach a, uh, a line to it, maybe get a piece of uh, duct tape, seal it again, why not, pierce the duct tape on this side, put it over the side of your, uh, your boat, while you fish, you know, maybe get another fishing rod, just cast it, cast it out into the lake a little bit, on your other, uh, your other rod. I'm not sure if the kids had a great success with this at the where they were fishing, but in some of the some of the other areas uh, that I heard about, they did quite well with us. So it's back here. It is uh, at the price point we have it at. It's worth a shot. It's about half the cost of a regular fishing lure. So bring them in. Good luck fishing. They don't call it catching. They call it fishing. <laughs> I heard that one from an old timer. Anyway, enjoy the rest of your day.